Hello, one and all, this is Luckless Love Locks, and welcome finally to Half Life Alex. This is absolutely insane. This is the second VR game I've played. I uh, did a little bit of a test with a uh, test stream with The Room VR, which was really cool. And I'd like to, oh man, that's awesome. I'd like to start off by thanking uh, Christopher Odd for helping me to make this series happen. I really appreciate all the support he's given me and uh, he's really the reason why I'm able to play this with all of you. Look at this. Isn't this cool? We got the finger movement. So yeah, I'm totally new to VR pretty much and it's gonna take me some, uh, some time to probably get used to this environment. Uh, I got everything set up. I think it's gonna be good for you guys uh, on spectator mode. I've got uh, I've got it set to uh, camera smoothing medium. I could change it uh, later if you guys want me to, um, but hopefully this will work out. Just let me know in the comments section. I'm just gonna jump in, everybody. This is so exciting. Let's go. Oh, difficulty, challenging combat, normal. Hmm. Very challenging combat. <laughs> I think I'm probably gonna play on normal, and if I find it too easy, I could, I could always change it. Movement blink. Teleport to destinations with a brief screen fade. Most comfortable movement type. Fast linear movement. Shift. Continuously based on your head orientation. I have a feeling that's gonna make me sick, so I think I'm gonna go with fast linear. Let's try the screen fade. Because that's the way it was with uh, the room. Weapon hand right. Yes, I'm right-handed. So I'm going to be using my right hand for weapons. It's going to be so weird to, shoot, to be shooting guns. You can choose which hand controls your movement by selecting the appropriate binding in the Steam VR controller bindings menu. Okay. Oh, and there's add-ons as well. Yeah, there's um, there's actually mods for this game already. So if, uh, if we enjoy this, and I, I assume we're all going to love this. Um, I could play through some mods. I noticed that there's some some people who've made levels and stuff like that. Let's do it, everybody! Let's begin! Start game. I have not jumped into the game yet, so I, <laughs> I don't know what to expect. What happened to my hands? Oh my god, my hands! Press trigger to start. It is five years before the collapse of the Citadel and the death of Eli Vance. Subject, Alex Vance, age 19, female. Affiliation, human resistance. Current assignment, reconnaissance. Ho <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, I've got my hands. So we're in City 17 again. <gasps> There's a pigeon! Push to move. Ah, oh, yes. So we can hop around like this. Push to snap. Oh, I see. So we can turn around like this also. I don't know if this is going to be the best way to move. Maybe I'll mess around with the settings and see which one I like best. I didn't want to boot up the game uh, before to try it out because I wanted to see. I wanted to have this first reaction with all of you. Oh my god, it's so cool! Oh, and look at that. My hands actually react to the environment. 
Oh, that is freaking cool. People down there. It is beautiful. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, pigeon. Birds over there. And there's the citadel in all its glory. Look at those cables going through. Oh my god, this is going to be a crazy experience, isn't it? So what's going on with this? Oh, nice. Kind of nice. Oh, look, there's someone biking. Oh my God, this is fucking cool. There's the play area. <laughs> can I like, oh, you can pick up the books too. And from here to there in under a second, Dr. Isaac Kleiner brings a new understanding as well as a compelling thesis to a subject long considered to be the stuff of science fiction, teleportation. Taking us through the history of this burgeoning and con uh, controversial new field in theoretical physics, Kleiner seeks to explain the unexplained in this thorough and often thrilling peek into a potentially transformative, transformational new addition to humanity's future. From here to there in under a second. Oh man, this is gonna take some time to get used to everybody. Dr. Isaac Kleiner. Oh my God, can I like, oh my. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> this is crazy. So can I like, can we do this? There's the freaking chair that I just threw. That is crazy. Pick up bricks. Of course, the first thing you do is uh, throw stuff, right? Wow. <laughs> this is so much different from the room game that I played. Can I? You can. <laughs> oh, look at the strength. Wow. What else do we have? Desiccated sustenance, uh, sustenance bar, that's funny. Oh, it's amazing! Can I fill this with water? I got tape. I can drop the tape in. Wow. Wow, this is amazing. I could just play around in here for a while. I think they added, uh, yeah, they added liquid physics too, recently, I think, right? So what if I like... Oops. What if I do this? Oh my god, that is fucking awesome! Wow, the detail is staggering, guys. Hold on. Does not react. Okay, should we actually play the game? <laughs> I think I want this in case someone uh, decides they want to attack me. And I also want this. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, wait. What happens if we, like... No, I can't eat it. I tried. 
Matches? Safety matches. Can I, uh... Oh, you can hear them? Can you, like, actually open it up? You can touch it. And there's, like, haptic feedback, too. Oh, wow, that's just amazing, guys. Can't touch the flowers, though. Okay, uh... Let's see if there's anything else. It sounded like numbers. It is truly amazing. This is fucking crazy. Okay, let's start. Let's start moving. I'm kind of curious um, to see what it's like. with the other movement uh, methods. Look at the details. Oh my God, it's tremendous. I can just pop it here if I want to. What if I, uh... sorry bird. No, uh, I can run my hand along this, but I can't grab, can't grab this. I got. I gotta try. I gotta try. Oh! Sorry, bird. It's for science. This is fucking amazing. <laughs> I had no idea how amazing it would actually be. Ah. Two. Oh, we're tracking. We're tracking the construction. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. And I can even erase what's already there? I can. So, what happens if we, like, uh,. I'm looking through my, uh, my right eye. Wow. <laughs> Wait, it goes up. Wow, that is just absolutely amazing. Can you grab these too? Oh, you should go in here. Nope. There we go. Nice and secure. I'm feeling like very delicate with things. Incoming call, Eli Vance. Pylon 7B resupply yard. Can I turn any of this stuff? Oh, you can. I didn't mean to give you the finger. I'm sorry. It's totally unintentional. Uh, okay. No, don't drop it. Oh God, don't break that. Don't break that. No, 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 no. Stay there, stay there, all right? I'm gonna hit the button. Alex, how's it looking up there? Oh my God. Okay, Metrocot movement is normal. Same for the combine patrols. Dad. How's it going in the stockyard? <laughs> One combine mini reactor from a ship in the 4,000. They're never gonna miss it. Here, see for yourself. This is actually insane. Someone's hacked into the combine construction network. Don't get greedy, guys. We're not made of time here. One minute and I'm out. Guaranteed. Oh, also, I spotted the combine moving supplies into the quarantine zone. That place has been deserted for years. Hmm. That is odd. Uh, well, what is well, we'll look into it when we get back. What is this? Meet back at the safe house, baby. We'll be there soon. It's, it's so good to see you, what Dad. Would you? Terrific. Can I grab? Oh, I can't. I can't move this, but I can. Oh! <laughs> oh my God, guys! 
It's so it's so realistic. I feel so in this that I thought this is the cord for the VR. Can't see. So you can't grab everything. Just fondling fondling the bag. But just just how it does like it, the hand follows the wall. This is uh, this is an amazing achievement. What about this? Can I pick this up? No. Can I like? So you might have noticed. I was tapping the the monitor before. It does actually make a sound. I think. Just knock that off. Get out of here. Okay. <sighs> I mean, I could play around in this all day, but we got. I was not paying attention to anything. <laughs> anything Dad said. Cool. The detail. I don't even know where I am in my room right now. So if you if you don't grab it, your hand goes through. You can actually slide it back and forth between your hands. It's exactly what you'd ex how you'd expect it to work. God, I really wanted to walk through that. <laughs> So you guys should also see uh, subtitles. Oh. Wow, the lighting is tremendous. Press and hold to toggle game menu. Oh. Oh, should we try? I'm gonna try something. Preferences. Let's try this uh, shift. Yeah. You guys let me know what you prefer. I'm sure some things, oh, that kind of makes me feel a little bit sick. Let me try the other one. Continuous, move continuously based on your head orientation. Oh my God, no, 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 <laughs> no. Oh no, oh, that's making me so dizzy. Maybe I would get used to it, but. Oh no, no, that's making me so dizzy. <laughs> What's the other one? Uh, hand orientation, no. I think I like blink the best, but you guys let me know. Hand climbing ladders off. Hand climbing ladders. Let's try that on. Barnacle lift on. Oh, that's going to be weird. <laughs> I don't know about this hand climb ladder. So I'm going to change that. Sorry, I, like I said, I I, just, I wanted to get the reaction right away, so I didn't I didn't load up the game at all. The just the textures is just amazing. Hopefully, it looks good for you guys. Looks and sounds good. I'm actually using the um, the Vive microphone, which is which is pretty solid. I might sound a bit nasally because uh, it's it's kind of pinching my nose. Oh, look at that! Holy shit! I can pick up just about anything. Wait, paint? Yep. Oh, <laughs> it's it, you don't have a body. So you, you go to like stop it from falling, like you want to catch it on your body, but you don't have one. I am the paint can. Whoa, <laughs> whoops. Oh, uh, whoopsies. Wait, what happens if I, can I smear it? No. That's right, you're getting all the advanced gameplay uh, scientific attempts here. This is, this is just how I play games. It's probably gonna take me like 17 hour, 17 million hours to finish this game. The game actually probably is 17 hours, so that didn't really make much sense. Cool. Okay. Oh shit! Holy fuck! <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Oh, it dropped off the cabling. Whoa! <laughs> that scared the... I am gonna die. This game is actually gonna kill me. This game is literally gonna kill me. Wow. The camera over there. Can you like break the boxes? Stick. Ah, stick. Oh, look at that. Ah. I found a way to break the game already. To be expected. Hmm. Oh! Oh, one of the bugs! Hey, buddy! I can't remember what those are called. Oh, shit. I gotta- I gotta be careful what I... Oh, you still push it even if you don't have your hand closed. Mini reactor seems to draw power from Citadel's new power source. Standalone BME. Scaffolds are mobile. Are we sure these only produce electric power? Comms receiver up there. I like that you guys can kind of see what I'm pointing at, what I'm talking about. Hey, buddy. How you doing? You got some, you want some coffee? Are you, are you a coffee drinker? There's no, <laughs> no, there's no, oh, there is. Is there some coffee coming out? <laughs> is that like orange? It's like orange stuff coming out. Do I have some food for you or something? Can I open this? Can you eat that? No? I want to feed you, but I don't know what you what you eat. You seemed interested in this. Oh yeah. Going, you're kind of going for that, aren't you? I don't. I, I mean, I could pick you up and maybe break you, but I don't think I want to do that. Oh, look! So this is. Uh, we weren't sure where City Seventeen was, right? <laughs> Not here. Ugh! But uh, <laughs> that is so weird. So somewhere in this circle is where we're at. Interesting. That, can I give a thumbs up? Oh, nice. Thumbs up. Well, look at, it's so like, the tracking is pretty amazing. Pylon 7B. Okay. There's a tape here. Is there a VCR? I don't know how you like remove stuff. Oh, I see. Uh, that's that. All right. Broken can. Doesn't look like I can do anything with this. Okay. I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning. Can I mess with any of this stuff? Oh man, the the just the detail is staggering, guys. So we're recording some stuff. We're interested in what's there. The pylon? Oh man. Staggering. Oh, did I break it? I guess we're just keeping track of that. I don't think we actually do anything with this. 
I don't even know how long I've been playing for. But I am freaking impressed. Ooh. <laughs> can I... Can you, like, clean the floor? Looks like there's some... Something down here. Ow! Frick! Wait, can I hit myself with it? No, I'm just hitting the wall. I'm gonna take this with me, alright? Me and the broom, we're going... <laughs> we're going places. Wow. So we can only go... I'm a child, right? So I just like, I just hit everything. You can only go to the bottom floor. You know, just doing, doing my thing with my broom. Nothing to see here. Alex. Another broomer. She wants to, uh... Alex, are we good? Yep, they got the reactor. Easy peasy. I got the, the broom! The house right now to meet Dad. Go, we'll be in touch. Stay safe. You too. Whoa. One of the barriers. Oh, I forgot I had the broom. Oh, oh, water. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, okay. Oh! There's one of the civil protection. Can I push this? Pigeon! Oh, you're the one! You're the one. You, have you been following me around? I think probably you have been. Alright, B. Let's go, buddy! Holy crap. The animations. Hey, what's this? Oh man, the, the detail. It pretty much looks real. <laughs> any any money? Any money? Nope. We got we got some, uh, some some blue stuff though down here. Might want to get the here. Let me see if I can clean that off. No. Okay. Yeah. No. I got it. I got it. All right. The Ten Commandments of the Laundry Room. Don't leave your clothes unattended. Don't overfill the fabric softener. Can I push this open? Oh, you can. That rocks. Now I regret not smashing that, uh, that, that, that glass thing open. Can I go back? I'm curious. Oh, I can't jump over there. You actually have to go around. I can't go back. I'll have to try it some other time. I just love that. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna carry this through the whole game. You guys know that, right? Whoa! Look at the switches. I, I really hope this comes through on the recording. But the 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 detail is it's just it's staggering. Is it? This 
doesn't seem like a routine sweep. Are you sure everything went okay? It's not a routine 100%. sweep. It's amazing. Best sweep ever. Something's about the CP is right up. Keep your head down and be smart. Yeah, you should be afraid of my <laughs> my broom. There's freaking pigeons everywhere. Oh. Whoa, the looks on their faces. Tremendous and just the reflections of the uh of the uh the barrier. Fuck. Whoa! Whoa, that's weird. Uh, if you get too close to this, there's like this. Whoa, this weird thing going on. I don't know what that is. All right, let's go, B. Oh, I was stuck. Okay, I want, kind of want this. I want this fork also. <laughs> Can I grab just the fork? All right. I've got all the weapons that I need. Oh, neat. Just, <laughs> you can just clean up if you want to. So this is like, you could just make this a cleanup simulator. Tremendous. Well, I want to see what kind of power this broom has. Can I push? Oh, I can't push that. Can I push the box? I can. Okay. We're getting used to this. I think the broken glass goes away though, right? Oh, it doesn't. But I can't sweep it. Interesting. Okay. Enough, enough fooling around. We got work to do. Hack. Nope. The terminal. Oh, unlikely negotiator of peace. Garners trust as well as praise. Wallace Breen acknowledges detractors. I'm not a politician, I'm a scientist. Decades spent on the cutting edge of theoretical physics put Dr. Wallace Breen in a unique position to negotiate a sweeping multinational surrender to the extraterrestrials. Maybe it would be better if I just pick this up. Um, extraterrestrial invasion force known as the Combine. But a lifetime uh, ensconced in the bureaucracy of government-funded research with its security clearance. Let me just put this down too. Uh, security clearance and an emphasis on theory and long-term exploration over urgency and practicality has left Breen 52 ill-equipped for the moral and political scrutiny his actions have invited. Critics have accused him of rank opportunism, selling out humanity for simply being in the right place at the right time. Breen himself offers only a token rebuttal. Given the data and the extreme nature of the situation, I took the only possible course of action, he said in an interview televised last night. Portal storm continues, and to combine invasion is no respite, experts warn. Markets are in turmoil. This is, uh, does it say a date? Number 32. Internet address. Ooh! I wonder what happens if we go there. Hmm. An, uh, astronomical downturn. Historic bubble bursts upon Earth's sudden surrender to Combine. State of the market, not good. Scientists remain unable to offer any solution to the ongoing portal storm that has devastated cities worldwide. Not are they only closer to determining how to predict when new portals will appear. Does it say now? Huh. Nor, it says nor, okay. Sorry, it's a bit hard to read that. 
Okay. I think we're going... I think we're going that way. That looks boarded up. Let's go! I want to flip it around. There. Oh, I want to try to smash that. As you can see, I'm just going to try to do everything. Yeah, okay, okay. Can I... Can I actually... That would be really cool. <laughs> if I could pick it up from the from the end. No, it's solid. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I tried. Combine for safety. Wait, there's a prescription there. No details. Man, it's staggering. Like, you could just read all this stuff if you could speak the language. Ah, <laughs> uh, the light still comes through. Sloppy. Five out of ten game. Oh, bread. You can tell they... Oh no, I scared them. I was gonna say, you can tell that they set this stuff up just to play around with, like the bread. I'm smoking cigarettes here. Hold on. Grab ladder to climb up. I wish this would like... Oh, look at, look at Alex's, look at our fingernails. Oh, look at that. The gloves, too, have left, like, these imprints. Huh. So can I... I can toss the bread all the way over there, and it's probably... It's just going to stay there. It's, it's, it's unreal. <laughs> well, it's probably source, but you know what I mean. Okay. All right, B... Let's go, buddy. Oh, no. Oh, my God. That's fucking weird. I like it, though. <laughs> How do I? Oh, it just takes you there. Oh no, where'd my fork go? <sighs> Who are we without our fork? That's fine, we still got B with us. That's all that's important. way oh man okay just let me see what happens let's drop B down I wish that uh, this is where I wish the movement was like if I could like move through like this be I'm afraid to we got each other though Thank <laughs> you. 
didn't steal anything. You don't care what you see. No one, I didn't see anyone. Oh damn. Dad. Oh my god. Wait, wait, no, no, no. No, B. Oh my god, I lost my broom. Oh, and dad. That was fucking... I've got no words for this. This is impossible to to describe. <laughs> oh, 